Yo, welcome to the Morning Hustle is a guy who is actually no stranger to the Morning Hustle because he made viral waves on his whole Kim Kardashian take a couple of weeks ago. And uh, he's here to bring it to you live, man, right here, man. What's up for Hassan? Saeed, what's going on, my G? Uh, good morning, cousins. How's it going? Everything is everything, man. How has your, your social media been blowing up, you know, over the last couple of weeks? Because you already had a wave going. Right. But, you know, sometimes when you say certain names, the wave get bigger. Yeah. You know, uh, the Ashies found it. They did what they do. I sell skincare. I told them to come get them some. They left it at that. <laughs> the Ashies found it. I rock with that, bro. <laughs> so uh, there's another person is, uh, you know, making waves right now because, uh, you know, he was in jail, got out of jail. And, you know, and his family is still like, you know, barking about it. We're talking about the one, the only Jesse Smollett, man. What's your take on that, brother? Listen, uh, I have thoughts. I got thoughts. Here it is. Listen, Jackie Smollett said the reason his brother Jesse didn't receive more support was due to the homophobia in the black community. I don't know about that. <laughs> you know, you can indeed find homophobia in the black community like you can find it in any community. But as a lifelong member of the Alphabet Gang, I can also tell you that you don't need to identify as L G B. T, Q, A, I, or plus to know a stunt queen when you see one. So my question is, was the problem systemic homophobia or was it that Jesse refused to use his quick ass Rado to tell the truth? And now I can't speak for everybody, right? But mm -hmm. most of us couldn't get behind his story if we wanted to because it didn't make any sense. Like I'm looking at it and bro, you mean to tell me that you left your house in the dead of a Chicago winter's night because you wanted a Subway sandwich like it was bussing and ended up with a noose around your neck? <laughs> 22 episodes of starring in a network Negro novella and this narrative was the best you could do and you wanted us to rally? Look at the material, girl. It don't make no sense. Hassan, so now, I agree. For, like, <laughs> for his family to be so talented and him be so deeply rooted in the acting game, I expected some better acting and a better narrative. Bro, you need a showrunner, executive producer, something. <laughs> so now let's be clear. I don't think that he needed to be in no damn jail. Right? right. But I don't really know how Jesse thought he was going to play in the face of the most racist police department in the country. And the competition is stiff, but how he thought that was going to happen. And it wasn't going to be no problems. So no, Jackie, we know what homophobia is and we know what it's been. And we know that it will continue to be a barrier to our collective liberation as a people. And there's plenty of room for improvement, right? No one's arguing that. But you can't ask us all to do better and to hold people accountable, but put blinders on when it comes to you and yours. It's Uchi Wally or it's one mic, but it can't be both. He going to get off my porch with that. Now, when he announced that he was the gay Tupac, how did that make you feel? <sighs> <laughs> Sick, <laughs> Na nauseous, right? Like, it's like chocolate and mustard. These things don't go together, bro. What are you doing? <laughs> I've never heard them mentioned in the same sentence. <laughs> same, just yo, like that. Yo, well played, yo, bro. You, you, the way you describe things, your metaphors, the way you put it together, you should be out here like, you know, I, you need a label deal. You know what I'm saying? Like, get this, <laughs> get this man a beat, man. If I'm people open. want to tap in with you more, man, and uh, check out some more of your material, man, where can they go, son? Yeah, you can find me on Instagram at hey underscore Hassan. And you can follow my brand at House Urban. It's H-A-U-S-U-R-B-A-N everywhere. You know, I'm out here. Come through. For real, for real. You're actually selling like moisturizing stuff? To, to, yeah. To I'm a people? Yeah. And you know, the weather tripping, so you're probably ashy right now. But listen, we make literally the best body butters and body oils on the planet. And this is according not to me, but to Beyonce. So take that what is worth. Oh, if the queen said it, then, you know, you know the, the hive shall follow. Look, we on the list, so check it out. Hey, Hassan, appreciate you for pulling up on us, man. Go get you some body butters so you can go out there smelling like something this summer. You know what I'm saying? Attract a few bees because it's all natural materials that you're using as well, right? Correct, correct. Yeah, you did your research. I love that. My man, my man, one time for Hey, Hassan, be sure you follow him and tap, tap, tap on in, man. Appreciate you, my G. Yeah, y'all be easy. We, we are the morning hustle.